this is Stormin' at Dawn. She's, um, her sire is, um, Storm is what we call him, big part in our little lifestyle. Her mom's Desi Dawn. She was born at our house and she's a, kind of skittish, but very good horse. This is Chirp Service. As you can see, she's kind of wound up. Um, I'm pretty sure we got her as like a yearling. Um, she's our, one of our very fast horses. She's amazing, very sweet. A lot of people like her. This is Ella. She's kind of lazy, but she's she kicked my dad in the butt. And uh, yeah, that was a, that was that was funny. But here, Ella. No. Okay. This is Miss Dutton. Me. Um, the her owners named her off of Yellowstone. She's has a beautiful marking on her belly. She's very sweet and kind, and a lot of people like her. Here, Miss Dutton. Here, babies. Here, treat. 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 This is Frosty. Um, she's beautiful. She was, I actually was the first one who groomed her and taught her how to take treats. So I was like maybe six at the time and I would get up on the gate, the pin that she was in, she would come right over just like this and I would brush her back. And she was, she definitely taught me how to do a lot. This is Swanage. She's beautiful she's um her owners are one of our probably best ones she's pretty fast she won her first her first race that she ever had she's sweet a lot of people like her come here babies come here mama okay this is granny is what we call her she is the reason why we call her Granny is because um, her real name is Connect Granny's Drink, but we call her Granny because she's clumsy and um, she's pretty lazy, actually. She's, but she's also really sweet and everybody likes her. And I just dropped your peppermint. Most of these horses are just yearlings, so they don't really know how to eat peppermints. This is my racehorse. I saved him from being a jumper with his sister. This is slightly crafty. He is so sweet. Right now I could hop on his back and he would not do anything. He's basically a pony. Hey, Satie. Hey, sweetie. You want a treat? Don't get up, it's okay. I'll bring it to you. Hey, bud. Treat. Oh, there. Very sweet horse. Um, my pony died a couple of years ago. He was actually the horse that let me ride him. I would ride him around this barn all the time. This is big girl is what we call her. Her name is Briar Thicket, but she's she's very sweet. A lot long neck of hers definitely helps her win a couple races, so that's good. Marvelous Thunder. He is so sweet. Um, he had an injury. He was really fast, and then he had an injury, and that kind of slowed him down a little bit. But he's still pretty fast, and he's very sweet. He's kind of like crafty. Okay, this is one of my favorites. This is Pat, um, Pat's a gal, but we call her Patty. She, her mom died at birth when, um, her mom died at birth. So she was bottle fed is what um, somebody told me. But that would explain why she's very nice and sweet and everybody likes her. Everybody that comes here loves her because she just, she lets you rub on her and pet her and He's just an awesome horse. Here, Mama. You want a treat? No. It's okay, Mama. You're okay. You're okay. Okay, this horse ran yesterday. Chai T is her name. I call her Coda because I read a book 
about a horse named Coda, and the horse in the book looked exactly like her. So, and the horse in the book's name was Coda, so I just kind of call her Coda. People get annoyed at me because I call her that, but this is Olivia, and she's so sweet and kind. And she loves everything. She, you put something up to her mouth, she'll eat it. This is Reup. That Olivia and Reup look identical, but Reup's a little skittish and doesn't really. They're both babies, but Reup's just a baby, baby. Pretty sure he's two or three now. This is American Megan, but we call her Megan. She has a sore foot back there because in the trailer load she hurt herself on the way up here, but she's crazy. She's just, <laughs> everybody kind of likes her. And <laughs> what, you smiling? This, we call her Princess because her real name is, let's see, Cario Prince Perfect Prediction Small Batch Sales. So that's a long name for, ev for everybody to kind of just remember, so we just call her Princess, but. Um, the one that I didn't know the name to, Megan, and then Princess, those are all horses that came together and a load of one of our other owners. Okay, Twisted Dixie. He will also eat anything that you give him. Her's owners are one of our favorite owners ever. They're so nice and sweet. And they have really nice horses that run very good and fast. So we like them for all of their qualities and I almost skipped to these ones. This is Lady Astrid. We call her the deer because she's, um, believe me, we give her like a bucket, a, two buckets a day. And she's still not skinny, but she's very fast. And um, yeah, she's a good horse. I've had her a long time. This is um, Half Scout. She, she's our, um, one of our groom's horses, but she's very nice. My dad trains her and kind of just worked out. But he's had her for like a year or two, maybe three now. And then my one of my favorites out of them all is my pony, Silk. As you can see, he's very spoiled and loves everything. So it's peppermint, come on, dude. Thank you. Um, a lot of people love him, a lot of people try to buy him from me, and I always say no, because he's a part of the family now. He's he used to be my grandpa's horse, and he was my mom's backup barrel horse, and now he's mine, and so he's been through a lot of generations, and he's just a good horse, and he'll do anything that you want him to. This is Courageous Capen. She, her and Silk are best friends. Like, they love each other. Courageous is very sweet and nice, and what, but once you take her to that training track, she, or track, she gets a little bit wound up and she'll go. She's dropped my dad, and all of these horses have like, a lot of them have never dropped anybody, or dropped, especially not my dad. And she was one of the ones that just kind of sucked back and, you know, flipped him off the top of her. So he's, she's definitely a, she's a special one. This is Southern Pecan. Um, he is, what's the word? Um, crazy, beautiful, and uh, crazy again. But he's pretty nice too. He's not as nice as some of the horses. Okay, Braska. He is like everybody's favorite. Hello, hello. My cousin wants him when, my cousin wants him when he's done racing. So he already has a home plan. And 
he's very spoiled rotten just like all of our other horses this is reef's destiny he is um he's we've had him for a long time um he's very fast he's won a lot about three quarters of all of his races he's just really incredible horse and uh, he's very sweet he's kind of skittish everybody likes him a lot of people like all of our horses this is one of the ultimate um, beauty type favorites this is Finbar Fury but we call him Fury um, he's actually Braska's half brother they look nothing alike but and act nothing alike but um, yeah everybody likes Finn I meant Fury because um, his looks and his beauty but once you actually get to know him he's pretty sweet this we call Monster. His real name is some, mm, something outlaw, but we call him Monster because I think he's either two or three now, and he's that tall. So, um, yeah. This is one of my other favorites, Florit. I love his name. I love his personality. He's so sweet. He's, like, he's almost like a pony, but he's not. He's, he's a racehorse, but if you look at his body, he's very little, and, but he's just kind of a good horse. This is the Flater. When he retires, I'm going to make him into a barrel horse, and he is going to be my barrel horse. And because, I mean, I have pictures of him, of um, me riding him at Oakwan in the stall and this is one of our special horses you could say this this is bandit point my mom won her first ever race on him and he um that was her first race that she had ever won ran that was his first race so it kind of just worked out it was here and it was just a special moment. It was on Father's Day, and her dad came, and it was just kind of incredible. And it's like, it was meant to be. So ever since then, that's been her favorite. And then we have my rabbit over here, Nibbles. I've had him for four or five years now. Um, he's <coughs> very fluffy, and he's sweet, and everybody likes him. And he, he's not too big of a fan of peppermints, but he'll eat them. And he has a carrot back there. He's spoiled rotten. And, no. and then we have the boss of this foundation, you could say. She's, he's kind of crazy and very sweet at heart, but... Delaware, as you can see, he is the ultimate time boss. He has the life built over there. Yesterday, I spent $800 on him of all of his stuff. That all is his. And I don't know if he'll play right now, but... Did you? Did you? No? Okay. There. We'll make you share it. We'll make you. There. Here, Bandit. Last year I had baby turtles, eight of them. And I managed to sneak them up here. And then they all died. So, um, they all escaped from their cage. So, well, they aren't that, but it's kind of everything. And there's the other boss over there.